directed area lockdown. What is going on guys, my name is Styles, and welcome to another Modern Warfare 3 commentary. My second one on my channel. And this is a team deathmatch on under change, I think it's called, I don't know. It's like underpass, but they changed a word. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm running the, uh, the probably the least popular strike package, which is the specialist package. Specialist because I'm special. Yes, and um, if you didn't, guys didn't know what that is, basically you get two kills and you get your first perk, which of your choice, but I'm using hardline, so everything's one. And the fourth kill, you get your second perk, uh, this is on top of your current perks. The sixth kill, you you get your third perk, and then I think it's the eighth kill. You then get unlock every single perk for that life. So imagine having every perk in the game for that life, and I do actually get that in this game, so you have a taste of what it's like. And if you fit your mind to it, it's pretty cool. Like, so it's like, I have dead silence, blast shield, sleight of hand, all these things, assassin, blind eye, pretty much a walking god, um, other than, you know, if, if a juggernaut's not a walking gug, then this is. And uh, talking of juggernauts, they're shite. Don't ever use them because they're crap. Well, the one I used, I picked one up and I died to one nade. It might have been because I picked up the nade to throw it back, but I still died to it, which is stupid. Because there's a thousand points of damage, but I guess nades do infinite damage if you pick them up. But um, moral of that story is don't pick up nades when you're in the drug well. Yeah, juggernaut suit. Another moral of the story is don't trust the system. Yes, that is a Lonely Island quote I just did. Yes, that, there we go, all specialist perks, 7 point streak because I'm using Hardline. And uh, I am using a Scorpion secondary. And yes, I have got it to the maximum rank. <laughs> yeah, I actually have a title for it. It's a beast gun. I mean, for those long term subscribers, you know I love the Scorpion. I mean, I had my first gold gun in um, Modern Warfare. Yeah, not Modern Warfare. Black Ops was the Golden Scorpion. And... That was my third favorite weapon, third or second favorite weapon on Black Ops, um, kills wise. And yeah, so fearless right there, ten kill streak, blah 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 blah, not very good. Um, yeah, this game isn't amazing. The score, I don't, I don't suppose. Um, but you know, that's not really what I'm about. I'm not about amazing gameplay. Right now, it's about tips, and um, obviously, I'm using the heartbeat and the silencer, the noob setup, of course. Nah, Jake's, it's, I don't know. It's a, it's a change of pace. I saw Dowsy actually using it. Better give Dowsy credit. Yeah, I watched Dowsy get a pretty good score on this, so um, uh, uh, he's my favorite. He's my favorite commentator. So nah, um, yeah, I just saw him using it. So uh, yeah, I thought I'd try it out. I like trying out new setups, and the specialist package seems awesome. It seems, you know, it's not something that I'd run every game, but it's something that's fun and a change of pace. And it kind of mixes things up a bit, rather than the same boring oh kill streaks. But um, yeah, so that's that's pretty much what I like about it. And I'm trying to, s I'm not playing with a team. I'm trying to stick around sort of the edges of the map. But um, you do die incredibly fast in this game. So once you start getting shot at, you're usually dead. So that that's 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 probably my my errors in this game. Perhaps I don't know. But um, yeah, yeah. So that's that's what it's like. Um, you know, yeah. So I did, I did actually do a commentary last week uh, explaining an event that I was going to go to, and I did that today. And um, it's basically, it was called Your Future in Dis Digital, and it was an event at a, it was kind of like a television studios that they now rent out to people. And it was, it was okay. I mean, it w we went last year, and it was better. It had more, you know, 3D kind of next generation stuff. This time it was more about like business talks and stuff and I listened to a 45 minute presentation on animation and it was very very boring um, <laughs> it wasn't it wasn't that great but um, I don't know they, 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 I was hoping to come back with funny stories but really there was none we kind of bunked off for a bit and that's about it <laughs> but um, yeah um, Modern Warfare 3 man um, I'm hoping to do an actual like a complete review video of the multiplayer because well, you see people like IGN or companies they do reviews the day the game comes out now honestly you can't do you can't review a multiplayer or give it a score out of 10 until you've put 
you know, more than an hour into it. You need you need to go for a whole prestige, I reckon, before you can make a judgment on the multiplayer. Because the first day I had this game, I struggled, you know, I really struggled. And I was getting very angry, and I still have friends that get very angry. <laughs> Syndictive. <laughs> yeah, I actually have recorded uh, <laughs> content of him just screaming his head off at every, everything that happened to him in that game. It's funny. But, and yeah, yeah, it's very frustrating, and then, I don't know, I kind of, I'm kind of picking up a lot more right now, um, the more you unlock, the more, you know, experience you get in it, the, the, you know, you get a feel for it better, and it's, you know, it plays out differently to the other cards, so you have to play it differently, you have to play it like Modern Warfare 3, which people are still discovering, so, if you guys are getting mad, and it's not all what you hoped it to be, just, just stick at it, I mean, you know, it's going to end up like Black Ops anyway, isn't it? Where we're all going to bitch about it eventually. But, um, yeah, it's just the sticking at it. Now, um, a tip, I guess, if you guys wanted to use this kit is always run hardline because a hardline allows one kill and you've got your next thing. Now, if you wanted to get, um, hardline pro quickly, you know, use this package as well because one kill and you get a kill streak. I think that's generous and, uh, I think that's worth you know, using if you wanted to get Hardline Pro. But, uh, if you guys haven't noticed yet, you <laughs> you get um, Pro Perks a lot easier in this game as well. I mean, I, I got Assassin Pro because I was just using it for a game and I got it in one game. It might have been one or two games, but um, there's the end of the game. Final Kill Cam with the Scorpion with the Silence. They're probably, probably the most underused crappy guns <laughs> in this game. But um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like if you did. And I should have a dual com with Syndictive very soon if you guys are fans of his as well. So, peace!